Hello Aries, I hope you're all doing really well. This reading is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign Aries. So if your Sun sign does not resonate, you may like to take a look at your other signs as they may resonate more strongly with you at this time. If you like this reading, please like, subscribe, comment and share the content if that's what you feel like doing, Aries. As always, I really do love and appreciate you all so very much for all of your support on my channel. And for private readings specific to you, please visit katietarot.com. So Aries, let's take a look at your week ahead. Calling in your angels, your guides, spirit and source energy. Guidance for Aries, please, Spirit. So guidance and messages for Aries. Guidance and the messages that Aries need to hear right now, please, Spirit. Messages for Aries. This is a general reading, so just take what resonates for you and just leave the rest. Not all the messages are going to resonate for you. Guidance for Aries, please, spirits. Guidance for Aries. Guidance for Aries. Your energy, Aries. The energy around you. Let's take a look at your first message. Intuitive communication. This is an extremely powerful energy, Aries. And it says on this card, silent whispers of the heart. You are really going to... Be tapping into your intuition this week. Really listen to your heart, Aries, because you're going to receive messages, intuitive communication from your heart center. So you may find that this week um, you're uh, dealing in, with a person or in a situation and you just get a feeling, an overwhelming feeling, like a gut sensation. You know, really listen to and heed that either it may be a warning or that guidance or perhaps it may be a positive thing, you know, and take action on those feelings because this is, uh, you're picking up on something that um, may be hidden, uh, going beneath the radar, um, you know, so there's um, an, a very strong element of you being highly intuitive this week Listen to the silent whispers of your heart because it's not going to lead you astray. There is some positive information or information um, in general coming toward you through your intuition um, this week. So very important. Listen to your heart, Aries. Let's take a look at this card here. Wow, we have spirit messages. So we got spirit messages, observe limitations. But spirit messages as well as intuitive communication. So Aries, this week, really pay attention to signs, symbols, omens, um, any kind of spiritual symbolism that you may be working with intentionally um, or anything that you take notice of or that catches your interest uh, this week, Aries, because there's a message there for you and it, if a message does come through for you from spirit, I feel you're not going to miss out. You're not going to let it slide by. It will be very prominent and you will think about it. It will make you stop and it will make you think about the message that's, that is meant to be coming through to you. And of course, the message will be different for everybody, different circumstances. But spirit messages coming through for you this week, Aries. You may like to take notice of your dreams. Dream journaling and this type of thing may be very powerful uh, for you this week, working with animal spirit, um, taking notice of animals in your environment, their behavior or an animal, um, a wild animal may come across your path this week and it will just stand out. There's a message there for you. Also spirit messages, not only from your guides and angels and spirit, but also from past over loved ones coming through. Um, I'm getting a strong message for you, Aries, that there's a going to be, um, an energy of you coming close together with someone and for some of you this is a past over loved one you're coming closer together with them meaning messages will come through from spirit you'll be able to hear them 
in a symbolic way, whether that's through dreams or um, other means. So I'm seeing I'm seeing that very strongly. Um, and that message may be uh, for some of you, I'm getting a sense it will be with past over loved ones. You'll know if that resonates for you. But also there's an energy here, Aries, of um, there's going to be a surprise twist to the to to your journey this week. So you may find yourself involved in some or synchronistic events here that uh, take place that bring you and another person together. Yeah. So so just take note of that. That's um, that's very important as well. I feel for some of you, we have the energy of acceptance. You are ready to release control of situations or people and lovingly embrace the rhythm of life. Yeah, so going with the flow, accepting what you cannot change, um, really opening up. I love this green energy here, very healing energy for you, Aries, this week. Physically, mentally, emotionally, if there's pain there or if there's healing needing to take place, I'm seeing that for you very clearly in that card assertiveness this situation can be healed gently and with love as you've requested if there's also a need for your strength and truthfulness with the other people involved we will stand right behind you as you speak your truth giving you strength and guiding your words spirit is with you with your communication this week aries uh, spirit is with you with your actions, uh, very strong integrity based energy here. And you're not afraid to speak up. You're not afraid to assert yourself in um, a dominant way, um, not a negative dominant way, but assert yourself in a dominant way because you're needing to in a situation. There's still gentleness um, around you. There is still um, energy coming from the heart. So it's not a power play. Um, it doesn't feel like that kind of energy. It feels very gentle, but very assertive and very powerful and a dominant energy coming through. So I should really like that energy for you, Aries. There's success and victory around you. Um, the actions that you take this week, Aries, will produce some kind of positive result for you. Um, you may find that others collaborate around you or work with you this week when perhaps they haven't been with you or working with you in the past. With Six of Wands, I'm also feeling for you is um, if there's a group situation or you're talking to another in a powerful way, perhaps giving advice, guidance, um, maybe in the workplace situation, there is an energy here of communicating not only with your words, but also with your actions. And um, that's going to speak very powerfully. What you do this week is going to speak very powerfully. Um, yes, your actions are very important. We have the Ten of Cups. Um, making your home environment uh, more comfortable, stable and happy in some respect is going to be a focus this week, Aries. There is a loving vibration here, being very comfortable in your space, whether that's your office space, your home environment, um, you're working on that, making it a vibrant energy and a comfortable energy for you. If there has been tension, discord around you um, recently, it looks like there's a good outcome here, or at least this week there's going to be, um, that, that energy won't be there um, according to these cards and the energies that I'm sensing. So it may be resolved or there's just a reprieve of that energy. We have the two of pentacles, having to manage income, money, finances, work, having to uh, not be stretched too thin in a very material way. OK, don't don't stretch yourself too thin um, this week, Aries. We have the ace of cups, new beginnings emotionally. So I do see this as the contact from spirit. I do see this as you accessing your intuition. So there's a new beginning in that respect. Messages coming through. Um, you may also feel a certain way about a person. Really listen to your feelings this week, Aries. Um, there is going to be a new start emotionally this week in some respect. So that's very positive. And let's take a look at this energy. The three of wands. Yes, your actions are very important this week. The wands, action, energy, passion may be reignited in your heart or in your life in some respect, Aries. 
you've put in some action, you know, you've done, you've taken steps in the past to get some movement in an area of your life or with a particular company or person. And it looks like there's with assertiveness and some dominance uh, coming through on your end, it does seem to be that there's a happy outcome here. Strong support and protection from spirit coming through this week, except what you cannot change, Aries and go with the flow. Um, and also be aware of not stretching yourself too thin in terms of material um, material things. So Aries, I hope you have a wonderful week ahead and I will talk to you all again soon.